welcome back to another video of Fonzie and today we're going to talk about the big light Panzer 57 or uh, a burger Panzer as I like to call it. Um, I've already done a video on this uh, little guy but I thought I'd do another one because I've been looking on the forums and um, there's a few people saying that you know it should get a BR change. I kind of agree um, but not with the re not for the reasons that people are saying. Um, the reason why I believe this vehicle needs a, a BR change is, well, it would only be fair with the um, BMP1 that gets its um, upgraded ATGM and it stays at 7.3. Um, and then this little guy, which is at 8.7 and um, has a standard tow, which does not elevate or move with the turret. So obviously if you slew left or right, the ATGM moves with you, but if you elevate or decrease your gun, the ATGM will not move. And as I explained previously in my uh, other video, it can make the ATGM quite hard to aim. So, um, but the reason why I'm making this video is guys are saying that the 57 millimeter cannon doesn't work real well. Well, that might be because you're using it wrong. Um, now, first up, we're only ever gonna use this stock round. Uh, and the reason why is because it's got fucking epic amount of penetration for, for the round size, 142 mils at point blank. And if you look there, out to a thousand meters, we've got a hundred, uh, hundred there, getting a bit excited there, uh, 91 mil of penetration at a um, thousand meters. So what that says to me is this thing can still penetrate and kill a T64 out to a thousand meters. And I've tested it, I've played it in game, and this is, on par, it is it is dead right, and um, yeah, so there's nothing wrong with this 57, as you would have seen from the, the start video. Um, it's quite capable of basically pawning everything it comes across, and there's only one tank that you will struggle with, and we're gonna have a look at it right now, and I'm gonna show you why you'll struggle with it. So we're just going to Russia. Yes, of course, it's Russian, Russian bias, and it is this behemoth, behemoth, right here, and that's the IS-4. And the reason why you'll struggle with it is because its side armor is 160 millimeters. Um, you also have these side panels here, uh, and you have to blow those off to actually get through to the 160, and then you don't have enough penetration to get through to 160. But there is this spot down here where the bogies are, or the ro uh, roller wheels, or whatever you want to call them. <coughs> bogies, I look, because that's the suspension, excuse me. It is 30 mil, so it is very trolly. It is, uh, and basically, it will give you a few problems if you come across an IS-4. What I would do is use your ATGM if you can, um, because you've got 430 mils of penetration to to get through every spot of its armor. But the 57 isn't going to be able to get through. Um, sure, you might get lucky, um, but I would use my ATGM. But um, Enough chit chat, uh, we're gonna jump into a game and I'm gonna show you guys how I play the uh, Big Light Panzer. Um, I finally got a positive kill rating in this vehicle now and um, yeah, it, it just requires, well, you know, call on those ancient skills from the ninjas and, and you will do fine. Um, one thing to note, it is a light tank. It, it's not a tank that you're gonna roll around the battlefield in and get like 10 kills or seven kills or something like you would in the KPZ or, or in a Leo or something. It's it's very much a support vehicle, you know. A good game would be two to three kills and, you know, two to three assists and a few caps. That would be a really, really good game for this little guy. So, yeah, enough to chat. Um, we're going to jump into a game and uh, I'm going to do live comms for it and we'll see how we go. All right, guys, cheers. So here we are on Modusk. Oh, excuse me, guys. Um, yeah, this is like take five. Um, I've had a few games this morning in the uh, big light, but um, they, they haven't been good games, and my team haven't been getting really good teams, and we're just, every game so far, we've just been getting absolutely steamrolled. Um, and that's uh, not something we really want. Um, we need a half-decent team. This might be a bit different. Looks like we've got a Soviet team. Uh, it is an up tier to 9.0, which is, yeah, I think um, since I've taken my KPZ out and I've been doing um, the bigger light uh, videos, I think I've had one or two down tiers where we're top tier at uh, 8.7, so yeah, that's unfortunate. 
Um, before we get into the action, but I just want to have a shout out to my bro, uh, Aussie Legend. You'll notice on my channel now, um, with the start of my videos, we have an intro. And that's due to Aussie. Aussie's uh, done that up for me. And so, special thanks to Aussie. Um, I'll throw a link uh, at the end of the video. And um, yeah, for Aussie's channel, you can check him out. But anyway, back onto it. So, we're going to go down here. We're going to cap Charlie. And then we're going to try and run up to Bravo and uh, see if we can't um, do a bit of damage around Bravo. Um, not really an ideal map for this tank, really. Um, this map is a bit of a knife fight at some times. Um, you know, sometimes you can pull off a little bit of a, a flank. Um, but on an up tier, you know, we're going to be facing um, everything that can hurt us. Oop, sorry, T62. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll go up to Bravo, see how we go. Um, this isn't really the best map to sort of showcase this tank, but we'll see how we go. We might be able to pull off something special. Uh, so, we do got to watch out there, make sure nothing's flanking. KPZ get axe from. I said there's a guy up on the hill over there somewhere, probably an MBT. I'm looking around frantic here because I don't. Yeah, there we go, look at that. That's that. Something over there. MBT. Uh, that was unsuccessful. So we're in a bad position now. Oh, there we go. We've got an assist for him. That was pretty unlucky with the ATGM then. I thought we would have probably wrecked him. Um, I don't know. I probably started firing a little bit late with the 57. Um, Look at this, this will be a kill. There we go. There's our first one, MBT. Now, I'm gonna reload. That actually took a fair few shots to kill that uh, MBT then. That's good. We've got a T64 flanking. I'm pretty sure there's a tank just over this ridge here. So we're going to reload, drop into this dead ground over here, and see if we can't come around and possibly get a side shot, rear shot on him. You can also hear a, a chief going to town in there. Don't really know where. Just check that wasn't a tank in there. Nope. <coughs> So that T64 is getting shot at. I think there is a tank on the other side of this ridge. So that T64 is shooting onto the spawn. Yeah, I can hear a tank. The enemy has most of the strategic zones. What do we got? Yeah, there's one there. I don't want to push but because um, we will be susceptible to getting shot from their spawn. Uh, what do we got? Oh shit, there's a chieftain. So we're going to actually have an ATGM shot at him. We'll wait for him to lose his spawn protection. Him. Oh my god, how did that miss? What the hell? I think he's still got spawn protection, that's the problem there. So hopefully he doesn't see us. We'll have another shot. And we've got his driver loader. Right, we're going to back up. 
Alright, we've got Bravo. Alright, another assist. We've now got a... That guy. He'll have spawn protection at the moment. So he's going to move back behind cover. Uh, we might be able to slot him when he comes out. There's something else moving over there too. Don't know what that was. We haven't got the um, decompression. So just move back. Something in here in Bravo. So we're going to back out. I don't want to spawn kill. Um, and we've already been axed. I believe there's a guy sitting up on this ridge here. So we'll just have a quickie looky, 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 looky. Yeah. Yeah, that's him there. That was a chieftain. Okay. That's good. Well, if we cap an alpha, I might go back to that spot we were in because we might be able to take a few of those guys out from their spawn. I mean, it's spawn killing, but hey, it is a small map. And um, oh, look at that cheeky bugger. We'll get a shot at him for sure. To be quick. A little bit of engine damage here. There we go. Whoa, we just bounced a uh, Sabo round then, I think. That is fucking epic. That is epic. I can't believe we bounced a... Uh, I can't believe we bounced this Sabo around then. So we've got two more tanks over at their spawn. Doesn't look like they're going to come out. They're in um, hold down positions. And I don't want to push them. But what we're going to try and do is we'll relocate again. And see if we can't get an ATGM over there. Yeah, there's one there. I don't know what that is. Have another look. What is that? Might be a conqueror. I'm not sure. And I think he's looking at me. Yeah, he is. So we're not going to push our luck. They're capping Alpha again. So we're going to bail from here. I'll just see if I can do a pair here. Thing seems a bit sluggish at the moment. Um, so yeah, we're going to head over to around Bravo um, and hopefully we can't pull off a flank. Uh, guys just ping the map that there's something in there. Obviously we can't see because of the smoke. So we've got an object and it doesn't look like we've got anything else around Bravo. So yeah, we're going to head around Bravo and sort of look on to Alpha. Um, and hopefully I protect ourselves from a bit of a flank. The <clears throat> they have kept Alpha, so I reckon the guy from Alpha is going to head straight to Bravo. Because at this stage in the game, that's what I'd do. Okay. 
hopefully that T62 moves up. We have got tickets there to to burn for now. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. M60, caught an M60 off guard there. Now we need to look into Bravo and find out what is in Bravo. So that's what was firing us before, was that M60. Alright, we got a Chief here that's just been hit. Oh no, that's a Conqueror. Alright, we should be able to get a nice shot at him here. Get the 57. Yep. Nice little uh, RCN shot there. Eek, we're getting strafed, not good. Goddamn plane. Alright. So, that's not a bad, I've done a little bit better than I thought we would. Um, yeah, so that's it's not, not a bad game. As you can see how I'm playing the, the tank, but I'm not, I'm not going out in, in like um, head on with the enemy. I'm trying to flank around where I can and sort of, you need to outplay them. That's, you, you really do. Um, so, what is that capping? So the ZSU's capping, that's good. So once we're repaired again, we're going to back out and have a look back down towards their spawn, make sure nothing's coming around this side. Yeah, look at that. What's that? That little bastard there. There we go. There's another one. So yeah, there's those um, my uh, ninja skills were tingling there. Sort of thought they'd try and come around that side. Um, it was pretty arsy then. I took him out. That was just um, a bit of a panic shot for that uh, T92. So we're gonna move out from here and we uh, head down to Alpha. Um, we're not going to cap, we're just going to neutralise it. I just saw another um, AA truck there coming out of their spawn. So there's nothing else. Yeah, we're not going to cap it, we're just going to um, decap it. Don't know what that was. Uh, looked like a rise P, maybe. So we're going to throw him off. And uh, we're going to. Oh, there we go. Game over. So that, that right there is a brilliant game. Five kills, one cap. So there you have it guys, um, that right there was my, uh, well that's my best drive out I've had in the uh, uh, Big Light Panzer 57. Um, yeah, that was that was an epic game, I, I didn't didn't really expect that, I, I thought um, we'd probably, you know, maybe get a couple of assists and, and that would be it, but yeah, uh, we obviously had a decent team, um, and the T64 that went up to the uh, north there really helped us out there, he did a really good job, so shout out to that guy, um, yeah. He was really on fire. Um, so yeah, what have we got? Uh, no air kills, uh, five ground kills, so that's a nice drive out. Uh, two assists, four criticals, 12 hits, one zone captured, uh, battle activity 88%, um, vehicle mods uh, 3,522, total lines 32,740 lines. Um, finished third, few awards, tank rescuer, uh, shadow strike streak. Uh, double strike, professional times five, and survivor. So, and you also notice there uh, that, uh, what's that, one, two, three, four, the fourth kill, it wasn't a Conqueror, it was an M60A1 AOS. So, yeah, oh well. Um, yeah, so, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, stay tuned, because I'm going to throw a few bloopers at the end of this one. And, uh, yeah, uh, if you're new to the channel, um, 
and you like my content, um, feel free to subscribe to me. Um, throw us a like if you like the video and as always, stay classy and I'll see you guys in my next video. Fonzie out. Thank <laughs> you.